Hey guys, so today's kind of different than we were planning. Adam got really sick last night. We think it's the dinner he ate. He um, was thrown up and stuff like all night. So we decided to stay home, which is totally fine. We've just been relaxing watching movies and cleaning stuff up. You're probably wondering why I look so teary-eyed. I brought a bag of jewelry on our trip. And usually I don't bring jewelry because I'm scared of losing it. <laughs> but I brought it because I wanted to wear some on my birthday. And I don't know, Amber always brings hers and so I thought, it's gonna be okay, like, she doesn't lose hers. So I just put it in a Ziploc bag and I just took a lot of it, like, I just took really all my favorite ones and all my special ones. <laughs> Yesterday for my birthday, I was, I took the bag out and I was putting some on. And I was kind of in a hurry because, like, I felt like everyone was waiting on me and... I have no idea where my jewelry went. I don't know, it, it kind of seems like a ridiculous thing to be crying about, even to me. But... I had some really special jewelry in there. Things that I wanted to keep to like... Show my kids and stuff. We've been looking all morning, I looked all night. Can't find them. And there's just like no explanation. I think going on vacations like really stress me out. And if you're an anxious person too, you'll get that. I'll let you guys know if I find them, but I don't think I will at this point, which sucks so much. But I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on, so. All right, everyone, so it's a new day. We are now on day six of our Oregon trip, and we decided to go to the coast again. Um, Adam had to stay home because he's still regaining energy and stuff, but um, the other five of us are gonna go. It's a lot colder today, <laughs> so we've all got our sweaters on. <laughs> yes, we do. But it's gonna be really fun. Just an update for what you saw at the beginning of this video. I still have not found my jewelry, which still sucks. Um, I'm hoping that it'll turn up when we're packing stuff up. <laughs> Sorry y'all saw me cry like a little baby, but it happens. But yeah, I'll get you guys some vids.
There are two types of people who go into this forest. One, granolas who are going on hikes, and two, hipsters who are taking pictures. That would be us. Yeah. We are the posers, but it's fine. Here comes your Oregon Tillamook cheese sandwich, Swiss and cheese. I hope you like it. Thank and you. hopefully you can find a man that can cook for you like your uncle does. Thank you. Oh, got him, coach. Favorite uncle. <laughs> That's the end of day six. Um, we are going to head home tomorrow, which is kind of sad got a long drive ahead of us um, we're gonna go to Boise kind of like we did last time just in reverse but um, we're gonna have another fire so I just thought I'd end my vlog here so I can get it edited and on the interwebs <laughs> I kind of wanted to address at the beginning of this video just really fast <sighs> I'm really super nervous to post that um, I feel like it was me being very vulnerable and you don't see a lot of that from me here on my channel. I've only done like one other video that was super vulnerable and it's really scary to put yourself out there in that way. <laughs> no one likes crying in front of other people, especially on the internet where anyone can see it. But I guess the reason I'm putting it on there is because I want you guys to know that everybody has emotion. And it's okay to go through those emotions. If anything, it's healthier because I was able to cry and I was able to be frustrated and I let myself get those feelings out. I feel much better today and yesterday. And yeah, like I'm still upset that I haven't found my stuff. It's very frustrating, but, but I know everything's going to be okay if I don't. So... Just, I guess, allow yourself to feel. Make sure that you're taking care of yourself and don't be embarrassed. Don't let anyone tell you how you should feel or make you feel bad about yourself. Just be yourself. I know it's, it's easier said than done and I completely understand that. I have a really hard time with this, but Let's help each other feel comfortable in our own skin. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow on another fun drive. I mean, we already drove like seven or eight hours today, like alone. So <laughs> I'm so sick of cars right now. Like I'm so sick of being in cars, but it'll be good to get halfway home and get all the way home on Saturday. I'm excited to sleep in my own bed, but but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching and for loving me and supporting me. Mm -hmm.